pool of Nutella on the bottom. We got married at first sight on. He wants to go see the alpacas now, look at her. This is actually like heaven. What did you say when I brought this back to the car? What the did you buy that? <laughs> welcome we are doing another staycation we're not abroad yet this year but this place is literally so cute i cannot wait to show you i found this place online and i was a little bit nervous about booking it i'm not gonna lie i, I did ask everybody that follows me on instagram do i stay here do i book this or not it was a very mixed review there was a lot of people that said no a lot of people that said yes but honestly, I think when you see this place, you are gonna be like so shocked. So what this basically is, is a little hut on the middle of a farm. Sounds really weird, but I'm gonna show you now as if I've literally just come in here. I'm gonna take you right outside and show you as if we are coming into the hut. Millie's out here. All right, Jay? Yeah. What do you reckon to it? Lovely. No one's seen it yet. It's good though, isn't it? It's lovely. Some cute little lanterns here, which I'll let you appreciate first. Such a nice touch, isn't it? But anyway, so, so dark outside. So I'm gonna show you like the farm in the morning and all of that stuff outside. But this is literally the cutest thing you've ever seen. So you walk up to it. This is a little pot with some fresh eggs from the farm, which we can have for our breakfast. And this is stuff that we can feed the animals on the farm. So I'm gonna show you the animals in the morning because they are literally the cutest ever. Um, but yeah, that was such a nice touch, so love that. And then you step up into here, and this is the little heart. Look how cute it is. It's literally so much nicer than what I was expecting. So we've got a little fire here with wood and everything. There's actually a fire outside as well, which I'll show you tomorrow because we're going to use that tomorrow. You come in and you've got a little like tea station. Absolutely love this. Like that is just farm vibes, isn't it? But like modern farm vibes, I feel like. Microwave, mugs, everything. We can have our cup of coffee in the morning, of course. Um, I've got a little thing up here with lots of teas. Plant thing, which I think is such a nice touch. Also really love the color of this wood, like how they've painted it. I think it's so nice. I've got a little toilet in here. It's like a compost toilet, by the way. They're actually really good though, because they don't have any smell. So I love that. Didn't actually expect there to be a toilet in the hut. I thought there was just gonna be one outside the hut, but there's actually one in the hut and one outside the hut, which is great because I always go to the toilet in the middle of the night. So I was not looking forward to going outside in the pitch black. Cute window with shutters. And then we've got a lovely basin with a little mirror in here. I just think it's so like funky, like how they've done it out is so, nice like it is actually modernized shut this door before we get about a thousand we're probably gonna get like a thousand bugs in here oh my god there's one there they creep me out oh it's gone oh my god it's probably gonna be on my head um anyway back to the hut so then actually this is literally so cute i'm gonna show you this first so we've got all nice little arrangements a couple of chairs tables so we can get this out for breakfast tomorrow but this is what i'm gonna show you oh that's millie's dog <laughs> literally wait for this guys it is so nice like it's the nicest touch look at that how nice is that she's literally given us if i can actually get it out like a whole platter board thing popcorn in there chocolate wine gums biscuit i mean that is just the nicest touch ever isn't it i was not expecting that so very very excited to tuck into that probably tomorrow and then through here is our little bed area. This is the best bit, right? Oh, Joe's already lit candles, look at him. Ambiance going. So there is a projector here, which basically projects onto this thing, which we've just pulled down, and we can watch films from the projector on here whilst in bed. Is that literally not the best thing ever? Like, I wish I had this at home. Just sat here in my bed, watching my projector. I just feel like this is literally the nicest thing ever like there's actually loads of room in here as well like i don't feel cramped i sort of thought from the photos am i gonna feel like a little bit claustrophobic um but it's actually bigger than what i expected and it's just done out so nicely that it doesn't feel like a hut if you know what i mean you coming out to watch a film yes? oh hey oh no look she's covering oh. me in dirt living that foreign life miller oh 
bloody hell. I literally can't believe how good this is, Joe. Are you happy? It's lovely, isn't it? Uh, do you feel like it's bigger than what you expected? I Deep thought we were going to be yeah. a bit claustrophobic. It's much more spacious. Yeah. It's a nice little bit, bit of work, whoever's done it. Yeah, definitely. So that is the hot tour from the inside. We've actually just ordered some dinner and look at the time. It's literally like nearly nine o'clock now. I just ordered some coke. Is that all right? Joe's just told you what we've ordered now. We've just ordered some Domino's. So we're going to have Domino's yeah, pizza fun. night with a film. Oh, diggy diggy dog. Why is what do you say? Diggy diggy dog. <laughs> what? Anyway, I shall check in with you when our Domino's arrives. The goodies have arrived. We've got two pizzas, some coke, and then the best part of Domino's, if you know, you know, we had to. We just had to. I literally do not remember the last time I ordered a Domino's, not gonna lie. I'm very, very, very excited for those. Got my face mask on, ready to chill. We're now trying to work out some like Chromecast thing where Joe is. Millie's made herself at home that she's, um, she's so tired. She keeps huffing at us like, can you just leave me alone? I just wanna sleep. It's good though, cause I feel like it means that she's cozy in here, you know? Update. We've got pizzas. Mm -hmm. What's yours? What did you get, Joe? American hot. Mm. Oh. Pepperoni and chili. Pepperoni and chili. I got, which I'm really shocked about this. And Millie's eyes. <laughs> Millie's eyes on the pizza. Um, I got the chick ain't. It was called. <laughs> That's literally the cringiest pizza thing ever. <laughs> the chick ain't. It's basically like. I think soya chicken pieces. I had no idea that Domino's did a vegetarian chicken option. So I'm very happy. Actually, the whole pizza's vegan, yeah. Cheese is actually good as well, because vegan cheese is a hit and miss. Like. So, very controversial. I added gherkins. <laughs> I feel like it sounds weirder than it is. I added gherkins to the top of my pizza, and honestly, I'm so happy I made that decision. It is like 10 out of 10. Domino's is good pizza, isn't it? That. Is not stingy on the toppings, is it? Oh my god, look. Oh yeah, I think that's ready to come off now. And hit the rocks. We have connection. We got married at first sight on. Look how cute you guys. You know you're uh, living in a hut on a farm and you're drinking Coca Cola out of a mug. <laughs> Da, da, da. Actually, Good. Mm. Yeah. Mm. They're next to nothing, aren't they? Lights out, peeps. Good morning. Look what we've got outside our window. Alpacas. <laughs> they're literally right next to us i didn't expect them to be like sat right here when i looked out this is where we've been sleeping and this is where the alpaca is i feel like you just have to love an alpaca Lily wants to go see the alpacas now look at her <laughs> don't reach <laughs> oh puppy oh, you want to make friends with them Oh my god. Oh, hey. Look, they're literally nice on nice. Oh my god. She wants to be friends. Look, look at her tail. Hey, guys. Oh my god, they're actually gorgeous. <laughs> anyway, good Is morning, Joe. Good morning. <laughs> How did you sleep in the hut? Well, I would have slept alright, but Millie bloody kept getting I know, up. yeah. Oh, blimey! And a good old butt scratch. Looking very, very fresh face. Um, anyway, I thought I'd show you the outside of the hut this morning because obviously we couldn't last night. So this is that little area where there's like the lanterns and I think just goes into like a field. Um, but this is the outdoor toilet, which is what I thought we were going to have to Look stay in. Plum. Look at the plums. Oh my God, yeah. She said they're ri really ripe. Them plums. Yeah. Right Try one. Are they definitely plums? Yeah. She said to me, "Oh, the plums are really ripe." I'm scared. At. 
definitely a plan. <laughs> <laughs> what does it taste like? You don't look convinced. No, I'm just not convinced they're right. Anyway, as I was saying, that's the toilet that I thought we were going to have to go out into. She said that Joe could use this and I could use the hut because boys are stinky, but... That is not true, though. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying to you the other day, all the girls' toilets I've been into stink. That's why have you been into any girls' toilets? I don't know it's what you're all about. Now. Well, look, there's another beautiful horse come in. <gasps> oh my god, that is actually stunning. Really look at the colour. <laughs> look at the colour of it. <gasps> oh my god. This is actually like heaven. I'm sorry, but if you like animals and you like the countryside, right, anyway, it's literally just like a vlog of horses and alpacas at this point. But this area outside is like a fire pit. So later, if the weather kind of stays dry we're gonna make a fire and i've bought some massive marshmallows so we're gonna like toast those we're even thinking about maybe cooking on this tonight and just having dinner here because there is like loads of pots and pans there's also like a big grate that you can put the pans on yeah. this is really good like it's well equipped is, isn't it is what you use as a barbecue and there's a little bench area here which you can sit out on and then obviously the hut but yeah, I thought I'd just show you the outside. Oh, that's my phone going off. So check what that alarm's for. Me getting cozied up this morning. Look what Joe's done. We're getting cozy in here now, guys. He's put on a fire, but he's gone out to get us some bread and some coffee because the coffee here is... You know what we're like with coffee, guys. We don't even need to go through this. <laughs> a little frying pan up here, which is what we're going to try and cook on. And we're going to use the eggs that they gave us fresh, so I need to get them in from outside. Anyway, he's asked me to put some more wood in here, but I've literally never touched a fire. Very concerned how this is going to go. God, I don't think I've ever been this close to a fire. Oh my God. Ah! I don't know how much wood to put in. It's not even on the fire right now. So I'm literally useless at this. Oh, there we are. That's how it's done. <laughs> We thought we'd just come out and have a bit of a walk. We don't actually have anything to do, do we? It's nice to just get away and like not really have a plan, though, isn't it? Do they know, do, do the uh, do these lot this lot know what we're doing today? I don't know if I actually said, but the reason we came up this neck of the woods is because I'm going to see my granny and granddad. I think I did um, in their care home later. So we're meeting my mum and dad um, at like half one. So we've got like loads of time. We went to a coffee shop this morning. Really nice coffee actually, wasn't it? It was lovely. It was nice. And we had a bit of banana bread, banana and chocolate bread. We might try and do the fire later back at the hut. So I can't wait to show you that. I'm so excited for these marshmallows. Yeah. Guys, I don't even know what to say right now. Basically, I was wearing a fluffy jumper, which you probably saw in the last clip, and it is so hot. I was literally sweating. And now we've got to go to the care home, and I haven't got time to get changed or go back to the hut. So I went into Sainsbury's. I thought there must be like a little crop top or like a nice bear. I'll just pick one of those up. Went into Sainsbury's, walked around the clothing section, which is big, may I add. There's a lot of clothes in there. There was literally not a single nice item. Like, not even a crop top, not even a vest top in sight. There was nothing. So, I proceeded to buy something in the sale, because I was like, right, I'm not going to waste my money. Just wait for what I'm wearing. So, I brought it back to the car, and Joe went, what did you say when I brought this back to the car? Why the did you buy that? <laughs> Right, this is what I've got. There's a sweat of it. <laughs> Look, I feel like I can partially peel it off. I mean, the neckline is not it, great. It looks a lot worse. 
It looks better on. on. It does look better on. Um, I like the colour. It's just the, sh the shape and the style of it. I feel like you don't get the full effect, but I haven't got any effect. choice. I have not got any choice. I'm going to have to rock this sweat vest for the rest of the day and act like I want to wear it. I've picked up some scruffs from the side of the road. Homeless. I picked up some homelesses that need to stay in the hut. We're going to try and cook some dinner on here tonight, so we've got some guests to cook dinner with us. <laughs> oh my god! Is that going to work? Dad, if you drop that in the fire, I'm going to have to pay for it. <laughs> what is this guy doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Alright, Joe. <laughs> it looks like it's a bit lopsided. <laughs> also picked up another scruff, my brother. This is my favourite one. Look at that, we got fire! Dinner was delicious. Now we're having dessert. What have you got for us, Dad? I have got Tesco's toffee cream meringues. <laughs> he sounded like Jeremy British, Clarks. <laughs> with British cream. That might be because he watches Jeremy Clarkson. Way too much Jeremy Clarkson. They actually look so good. Yeah, chew meringue filled with well, you're putting toffee them on cream. The barbecue. Oh my God, I feel like these are going to go everywhere. Yum. <laughs> we will good food good company and now we're about to roast some marshmallows on the fire what more could you want really look at these giant marshmallows i found in home bargains i'll show you the packet actually giant marshmallows they're literally massive they're so good they're literally perfect for campfire so, so our pancakes with a white chocolate praline Cheese <laughs> to the masses. <laughs> Not again. Good morning. We're just watching Matt and Emma's video in bed. They're eating a donut burger. Oh wow! What is that? Oh, how are you? What do you reckon, Millie? Oh. That looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> Why is she staring you up? This is making me very hungry for breakfast right now. This is probably the laziest morning. Feels like Christmas. I've ever had. Yeah, it does a bit. It does feel like Christmas. You know what? We're getting all the autumnal vibes coming on. Last night we were tasting marshmallows. This morning we are going to breakfast. But the place we want to go to doesn't open till nine, does it? Which for us. That's <laughs> late breakfast. It is a Sunday sleep. <laughs> us, uh, us deciding we'll be up in their faces like, at the door like, give me a smoothie bowl now. Nah. <laughs> give me a smoothie bowl now. Nah. Open the door. Give <laughs> them some slack. It's a Sunday. Yeah. You get, know? Get that blender on. So, 
place we're going to for breakfast. I uploaded a picture to Instagram, was it yesterday? Yesterday morning, um, of me eating pizza in the heart from the first night. And um, a lovely girl commented on it and was like, you need to go here for breakfast. And said this place called Morton's Bistro. So I looked up this place and I am not joking you, this is like our vibes for breakfast to a tea, isn't it? First of all, that looks like a smoothie bowl of some sort to me. It's Benedict with there we are. parma ham. <laughs> no, it's not parma ham. It's bacon. Anyway, that looks also very nice. Oh, I'm very blurry. There we are. Why like ten so chins from here. I don't look, I'm not this pale. Like, I don't even know what is that. It says banana bread for breakfast. It looks like some kind of banana bread with like a mascarpone or something. Oh, it just looks so good. So basically, everything that this place has looks like exactly what we would want to eat. So we are going to go there this morning. <laughs> All holiday she's been like knackered. So much excitement for one small little pup. Are you waking me up? Oh, I'm so tired. Okay. No worries. I'm not oh, in my <laughs> Are you stupid? Are you waking me up? She's never going to want to leave. You love it in your little heart thing, don't you? We're going home now. I feel sad. I really enjoyed that. I would highly recommend you booking this, guys. Like, yeah, so nice. We've had such a nice time. I said I could stay another night, definitely. I wish we'd have booked three nights. The weather's been banging as well. Yeah, the really. weather's been so like, it's good. It's not been too hot. If it was too hot, because it's made out of metal. It would have been hot. So hot. Mm. First night we were quite warm, weren't we? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to hold a dog and a water bottle and a bag. Um, cue me being really hot in this tracksuit for another day. But don't worry guys, I do have a top underneath, so we won't need to go to Sainsbury's to purchase any yellow sweaters today. Just pulled up. Literally five minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally five minutes later. It was around the corner. Um, first impressions, Joe. It looks, it looks banging. It looks very, very nice. I'm very it's excited. Very, very, oh, I'm so hungry as well. What's the time? 10 past nine on a Sunday. Also very ready for a coffee. Yeah, let's get one of those booths. Look how cute they look. Oh god, they look so cute. Number six. Lucky number six. Let's buy the smoothie bowl. Can I get a um, Americano with, do you have like coconut milk or anything? We have oat almond or something. Oh, oat, please. Yeah, thank you. Can I get the smoothie bowl? And um, we're gonna share the pancake stack. Would you like um, berries or banana and Nutella? Oh, what do you banana and Nutella. Banana, banana and Nutella. And I'll have the poached eggs, please. Thank you very much. Thanks. Very much. Thanks. So excited about this banana and Nutella pancakes. Thank you so much to this girl that recommended this place because so far we're very impressed. I mean, our food hasn't come out yet, but. Like Joe said, he's seen the food and it looked good, and the coffee's good. Pancakes of banana and Thank Nutella. Thank you. And I'll just get your smoothie bowl. Thanks. Thank you. Wow. That looks so good. How nicely presented. This is the pancakes we're sharing with a pool of Nutella on the bottom. Oh, wow. Thank you very much. Can I get you guys any sauces? Um, oh, good. Thank you. Okay, enjoy your breakfast. How good does that look? Looks so nice. Mm. Loads of granola we like to see. I lost one my camera. Oh my god. Look at her. Look at her. Getting mm. those now. I feel like the mascarpone and the Nutella goes really well together as well. It's like chocolate cheesecake. Yeah, that's what it's like. Well, that was insane, I think. We've absolutely devoured it. <laughs> Do you enjoy that egg mm. thing, Joe? Yeah. Must be well finished. If you come anywhere near here, 
Or if you book that hut. It's quite close to here. Leicester, like we're probably only half an hour. Yeah, not, from but not that far from Leicester. I'll pop the place up here. I feel content with that whole weekend. I think that if you go if you go out for a coffee <laughs> Just because the coffee is good doesn't mean you can get like a black americano and then pour <laughs> pour cold milk into not. it. Like Beth and ordered a black americano and had cold what was it oat, oat milk. milk on the side and she poured it in. It literally looked like dishwater. It, like, <laughs> it looked like dirty dishwater water. So it's I just think nice. if you're coming out if you're it coming out nice. for a coffee to like somewhere that does nice coffee, you have to get a nice coffee. You don't just get black coffee and pour bit of oat milk in because you can do that at home we've got a nice coffee at home <laughs> so we've now proceeded to order more coffee because joe's not happy with my choice so i've now ordered a flat white it's what flat joe orders white. all the time as people probably already know look i like the taste of the coffee like, hopefully not you're the milk. like i like the flavor <laughs> of the coffee but that's all part of going out for a coffee is the frothy milk and <laughs> it is Whatever. Comment down below. If whatever. You think that whatever. I'm right or she's right. <laughs> whatever. Whatever travel. Age. Witness. No, witness in the froth. See, that's what you go to a coffee shop for to get like. Oh, it does look quite good to be fair. <laughs> oh well, you're here witnessing me here today, drinking a flat white. Right, I think we're gonna finish this video here <laughs> because. We're only going to be going on a walk on the way home, so it's not really very exciting for you guys. If you enjoyed <laughs> us living our best life in the hut. We'd highly recommend that heart and oh, buzz off. just loved it. <laughs> There's so many washers around here. Joe's getting really angry. Make sure you give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Bing. Bing. And make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you aren't subscribed already, I'm going to go before Joe starts getting aggressive. Hit, Thank you so hit. much for watching. Bye.